Welcome back YouTube to our Summer's Gone Visual Novel Let's Play. If you haven't already hit that subscribe button, let's jump right back into it. If you missed the last episode, definitely go back and give it a watch. Catch up where we are in the story. Let's not waste any more time. Let's continue. I totally forgot about that. How could you forget that? Oh, right. Victoria is all you think about. Oh, shut up, Cheeto. Yeah, so unfortunately, there's an issue with this game where the music slider also controls the sound effects and everything for some reason, despite what the menu says. Uh, and the way the music is, I'm 100% going to get copyrighted. So I turned it down pretty damn low, so maybe it comes through, but... There may not be even any sound effects, unfortunately. I totally forgot about the fucking college. My parents died when I was three. Can't even remember their faces, but losing them didn't really affect me. I guess I was too young to know what happened. But Summer, that's a different story. You another flashback? Oh, nope. Four hours later. Oh, another dream? That's creepy. <laughs> Plop. Hi. Hi. Blowing some bubbles? Are we just gonna ignore the fact that you're in my room while I'm sleeping? I think that's for the best. Weirdo. I think 9 out of 10 dentists would confirm that you're the weirdo. Uh <sighs> All right, Cheeto. One time offer. You can go alone to the... No. You sit up. God, I hate you. God hates you too. Uh, in sense of joke, joke or nothing. Ah, uh, joke. Apparently he hates you too. Otherwise, you have more titties. Wow. You... Yeah, fuck you, God. What's that about? <laughs> Ugh, let's get it done. Finally, I'm going to meet the infamous Vic. Yes, we're on our way to the hospital. You go see the lady who got hit by the car. Aqualia Hospital? Bus or subway? Bus. Subway's only good if you want to go to the south to the beach. Or I need low quality drugs. Or a five dollar thing. Alright, let's get this done. That transition. Interesting choice. It's like the bus stop? I have a headache. From what? The sun. The outside. Don't let the fresh air in too deep or you might get used to it. guys is looking <laughs> yeah I have no card she has a student ticket I do you do you idiot we got it two weeks ago with our other college stuff I don't care just get in oh boy must be orange juice let's hope it is Where's Obama's kebab? It's been closed for like a year. Huh? I'm excited. What does Victoria look like? You saw her ID. It's an ID. Nobody looks good on an ID. Summer did. Yeah, she nailed them. Back to Vic. She's small, blonde hair, yellow hazelnut eyes. A cute face. Oh, I hope she's okay. Yo, Dave! Hey, Nami! Remember Dave? No. The one that was always on Adderall? I only know Adderall any. Oh, there's two of them. Okay. Do you feel weird? 
I was never here before. Why would I? You were here before. The, uh, violent incident. Oh. I didn't know it was here. Hold the door! Aw, oh, really? You didn't give me an option to do that or not? Ah, oh, I thought that would. That's interesting. That'd be a perfect place to put an option. Hello. We're looking for Victoria Fron. Are you family? Don't mean a lie. Yes. I'm Nami Fromm. This is Nika. She's in room 19. Thanks. What? What? Where'd you get that candy? It's mine. I got it for me and a friend. I don't want yours. I just want to know where you bought it. I'm not telling you. Come. Room 19. Damn, protective kid. Wants her candy. Oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, a flower. Hello. Who are you? I'm Nami. And this here... I'm here. Uh, this here's Nika. Okay, and... Why are you so rude? Victoria almost gets killed in a car accident after someone threatened to end her life. It's not okay to something to do with it. What's with you? You look suspicious. We're gonna buy some candy. We're here to finish the job. Oh, don't say that. Say nothing, just stare. Uh, definitely don't say number two. That's not the road I'm trying to take with this guy. Uh, let's... I don't know what that was up top. Where can I buy some candy? What? I saw a child in the waiting hall with some candy, and now I want some too. You didn't see a shop around here, did you? No. We're here to bring Victoria her wallet. Oh, I didn't know that she lost it. But thanks, you can give it to me. No. You will give it to Victoria personally. Why? Why not? He's the one who treated her after the accident. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks for that. It's a very stressful time. I'm Maja. Oh, that's Maja she was mentioning. It's okay. We totally understand. Could you explain to me what happened? I gotta say, yeah, I said in the last episode, um, the visuals in this are pretty good. I am definitely liking it. Like, they're very clean. She and I met at a crossroad. We walked together for a while. We chatted a little, and we were about to split up. She went across the street, and a car that was driving too fast hit her. I tried to grab her last second, but she was too far away. Is she okay? She's alive. They say she was lucky. Maja starts crying. Oh, I think she's alive. Probably to be damaged the rest of her life, though. I do apologize for not having being able to have the audio to go with this. Um, the copyright stuff, man, it really sucks. Get him into OR4. His lungs collapsed. This looks like a flashback. The sound of the opening door pulls you back into the present. Well, her face looks pretty good. Only a couple little dings. Nick! Maja? Yes, sweetie, I'm here. I don't know what happened. You had an accident. I, I remember you. I remember you too. Good. Interesting. Oh, she's looking pretty good. You don't look that fucked up. Dude. Are you in any pain? 
No. I feel like I've had a really long workout and didn't drink anything for the past four years. Hi. Who are you? I'm Nami. Nika's roomie. It's so nice that you two came. Right. We're here. We're here to see how you've been, and we're so glad you're mostly all right. We also found your wallet. Oh, thank you. Hello. How do you feel, Victoria? Groggy. I believe that. Are you all family? No. I don't have to ask you to leave. We have to go over some important steps. Okay, sure. Goodbye. Get well soon. Thanks. Maja brings you and Nami to the door. Thanks again. Hope everything goes well. Yeah. Goodbye. Bye. Seems like a sweet lady. Yo, Cheeto, slow down. Dude, what's the matter? Don't dude me. God, you could have at least said get well soon, Victoria. But no, you're an insolent fool. He's pissed. That's why you're mad? Yes, that's why I'm mad. She's just some stranger. It's about more than that. I'm trying so hard to make you likable, to reintegrate you in society, and... And you always fuck it up. We all were shocked when the whole summer thing went down, but man, it's been years. Get over it. What do you think I've been trying to do all this time? Do you think I enjoy my state of mind? I dream of her almost every single fucking night. I hear her voice every night. So please, stop being a cunt and worry about your own shit. You are my shit. I care about you. Idiot. Nami storms off. <sighs> well, now she understands. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, good girl. Do you remember what we're going to eat today? Don't talk to me. She is pissed. <laughs> Can we go so far? <laughs> sure, the other lady's like, what the hell? Why are you sitting next to me? I might not show it, but I feel bad for Victoria. I pity her. She didn't deserve it. Funny. Lots of things happen to people who don't deserve it. Oop. Oh no. You're my BB. Oh. I would do anything to get some closure. To find out what happened to you. Interesting. Some more kind of clue there what happened. Just disappeared. What are you thinking about? Thingies. All those places on Earth. You know, I'd really like to visit them someday. Eat all the weird food and swim with the dolphins. You can come with me if you want. Imagine all the things we can do. Let exotic animals fight. You know it. Oh, not me in the background. Why do you always buy weird smiley erasers? They're sweet, look. Hehe, <laughs> now they're kissing. Could be me and you. You and Summer, Summer gently rub your heads together. That's so cute, these guys. Can I have one? I don't have an eraser. Only if you give it back later. I promise. Good, I'll bless him first. Summer gives the eraser a kiss. And now, take good care of him. His tongue sticking out was like a French kiss. The toxicity of the question, what could have been? It's torture. 
and me being all alone doesn't help. I can't believe I'm saying this, but college might be the solution. I'll be forced to socialize. I really can't wait for them to get into more about what happened to her. They're being so vague about it. A few hours later. I need to get good with the Cheeto. I need her. Calling her Cheeto, I'm sure is not helping. When is she playing? Uh, ass face. I'm afraid. What? College is going to start in two weeks, and I don't know if I can handle it. Dude, of course you can. I'll be there too. I've become so antisocial. I wouldn't say that. Well, you lost your filter. But I have seen you speak with people. You can still articulate and speak clearly. My comfort zone is raging. Fuck your comfort zone. We'll handle it. Emily gently drags you back and wraps her legs around you. Do you know anything about college? Except why we didn't even get the chance to look around for other colleges, no. But I checked some forums, and it's a really good college, even though most of them were complaining about not getting accepted. I have to think about classes. I don't even know what I'm going to major in. Probably people. Nami lets out a little laugh. They have a D1 basketball team. Just saying. I haven't played in forever. Talent doesn't vanish. You still got it. Did you get your uniform? No. I don't think there's one. There is. If it doesn't get here in time, I'll just get one when we get there. So I found this weird porn site. <laughs> Dude, come on, no. It's traumatizing enough that I sometimes hear you moan. Can't be. I'm always extremely quiet. <laughs> Awkward. Noji should be home soon. I'm going to play some games until then. And... No matter what, you're not alone. We're always there for each other. Yeah. Wow. This episode is way different than the first one. That's for sure. Oh, but. Dude! Arr! What the fuck? College! Get up, bitch! Fuck off. You want one of these? You. Nami sprints away. Fucking Cheeto. A slight burst of anxiety shoots through your body. It was like almost noon. What's the matter with you? Hey! Don't call her names. This moron. Pew pew! I know, Nika. Nami woke up a little excited. Uh, did you get your uniform? No. You had to order it. There was no uniform. Yes, there was. Other students confirmed it. You look pale. How would you feel if some Cheeto on Coke burst into your room after sleeping for barely an hour? Yeah. It's gonna be alright. I'll go get a shower and get ready. Yo! You'll need to pay me to get through here. No! Yeah, you better run. And she is amped. Nami, did you drink coffee? Coffee? Good idea! Oh no, she's already hyped. <laughs> Alright, it's gonna be a little bit of a short one, but with that is where we're gonna end it off for today. And next episode, I'm assuming, looks like we're going to college for the first day. But wow, what an episode! It is, uh. Wow, that's very different. 20 minutes compared to the last one. I tell you, 
I'm not gonna lie, after the first video, I was a little, uh, a little concerned about how weird this game was gonna be. Uh, but now, I'm definitely more pumped and jacked about playing this and getting through it. Um, I did say they did for focus on story, which is why there's no sex scenes. So, I'm enjoying it way more than I was after the first one. Awesome! So, thank you so much for watching. Hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. Link in the description below for my Patreon if you want to support the channel and get exclusives. And I'll see you all in the next one.